Welcome guys, welcome to my tutorial 5 of my tutorial series of Timon Clenching. In this tutorial, we are going to look on how to add uh, or how to add water in our game or scene. So, as you can see, I'm lowering the terrain we made uh, last tutorial to implement water in it. So, like this, we have so all around this dirt looking uh, terrain. We are going to make it underwater so we can only see the lovely island we made last tutorial. So just give me a second and to lower this terrain and I'll get back to you. And done. I spent like five minutes just lowering this terrain to be underwater when I put in water. And I've checked and yes. It is underwater. So now, how to add water? So water first is a is an effect. It's not like real water, like not molecules or atoms or things. It's not H two. It's an effect. Because if it was real water, then it would uh, take too much processing power to actually have a lot of water, of water, like oceans and things. So it's a filter. In Shimanki it's a filter, it's a filter processing, wait, post-processing thing. It's a filter. It's just an effect. So how to create it? In your asset folder, right click anywhere you want on the any folder, I'm just going to create it in models, right click, new, empty filt filter post processor, file. If you don't have this option, go to orders, let me find it, uh, where is it, uh, here, filters, it was right here. Uh, Click on the filters category and click on the empty filter filter post processor file. Once that is done, name it whatever you want. I'm going to name it water ocean because it's going to be an ocean and water also. And click finish. Now we've created a filter, but uh, this filter can have many filters like bloom, cartoon age, depth of field, fog, light scattering, and also water. So we will select for this tutorial water because we want to make water. So click it and done. Now you should see water. If you don't. You then it's more likely that you don't have checked this eye thing. This tells uh, this makes it uh, see like in game what you will see in game. So click that, and as you can see, there is water. Water, and if you zoom in, you can see it's there are waves, and it's like natural water. Really nice effects. So you, as you can see, I've made it. I've made the terrain except this island completely underwater. So yeah. So it's great and all, but but like if we were run the application now, we will not see the water. As you can see, no water, only the island with no water at all, which is lame, boring. So, to implement water, we need to make, uh, we need to add it in, in our code, our main class. So 
to to add this you tap filter post processing processing implemented by control shift i which it doesn't find oh name it uh, what Oh, filter post processor, not processing. Sorry. Import it and done. We've import. We've made a filter post processor which will hold a water thing. So now load it with water equals asset manager, which is a thing. Created by Chimonkey to load anything to your games. Load filter. And if you can see it's models, the path is models and water ocean dot f which stands for Chimonkey uh, filter process filter post processor. So import that water no. Mo models water ocean dot t -f -f. done now you have imported your water thing but if we launch the game again there is still no water in the game so now we we, we need to in to make it vis visible, the way we do that is by tapping viewport dot add processor water. And the viewport is uh, all the f is uh, the camera. So we don't load it as a model because it's not a model; it's an effect. So we do it directly on the camera. Or else it will be too laggy, and yeah. So it's so it's done on the camera, and we just add the processor water. And now, if we test it out, you should have you should have water in your game. As you can see, it's beautiful. You can zoom in. Well, no, just go near the water and see and see the the waves and stuff and yeah and right now our island is spreading it we have a good island with uh, crappy grass texture okay stone texture and awesome design that I've made so far so yeah We've added water to a game, but this water is nice and all, and that's weird, I'm only like getting 60 FPS in that video, okay, anyway, uh, so we've implemented dead water in a game, it was simple, yet uh, if you would have done it, done it like how to create yourself without using Gmonkey you, you would have pe spent ages to do it. So yeah Gmonkey really helped us on this one. So next tutorial I know this tutorial was pretty quick but next tutorial we will start implementing physics like character walking and like walls and physics and yeah all physics things you can talk you can think of okay until then bye